Hello guys, how are you doing? Welcome to Sim UK. Uh, I have some good news. If you're a fan of Ships at Sea, or you perhaps you've been sitting on the fence looking at it and thinking, God, that crashes a lot. <laughs> yeah, we've um, we've been struggling, uh, as content creators especially, trying to deal with the number of crashes that the game has been having. It's been pretty intense, there's no denying it. But as of 02.35 this morning, we have got a patch which does seem to have fixed, on the most part, uh, most of the rendering crashes that we've been having. We suspected it was a graphical uh, related issue that was causing all these crashes to happen, and there were a lot. Um, and I can confirm, I streamed today for three and a half hours, and uh, it didn't crash at all during gameplay. It did crash when I shut the game down, but uh, by that point I'd saved and everything I was hoping to do in the day had already been done and saved. So, um, fingers crossed that will load up tomorrow, and I'm sure it will. So, uh, yeah, it, it seems much more stable. Previously, it was crashing pretty much every time I dropped a line and tried to pull it back in. So that's really good news. Um, in addition to that, a lot of the people that uh, were watching the stream have uh, confirmed that they've been playing for three, four, six hours uh, without a single crash as well. So it's looking and sounding incredibly positive. So I did promise you that I would keep you up to date with all the important updates and progression in the game. And this is a massive one because it gives us stability um, I would very much like to see, moving forward, if the devs watch this, um, the ability to have a beta branch so that we can keep this stable um, platform there for anyone who wants to play the game and they you know, want to progress their career, etc. And then for reviewers like me and anyone who's willing to take a risk, we can move over onto the beta branch and they can push forward you know, uh, new technology, new um, features, etc. And not worry so much that we're going to lose our content because we you know we've we've kind of opted in to do that and it protects you lot that wants to play the game properly uh, as much as possible whilst we're still pushing forward and trying very hard to get um the new lot of features out to you so there you go uh, really good positive news and hopefully that will at least tick a little box on the on the wish list of many of you out there who have been sat on the fence and thinking Seems a bit early access for me. So it is now, seemingly, having tested quite hard today, uh, a lot more stable. So it's definitely more playable now because it's not crashing half as much. Well, not even a tenth as much as it was before. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Stay tuned for more information. Till then, take care. Goodbye for now.